In this video, we're going to take a look at how we can create an Excel workbook using the Apache POI package, and we're going to be doing this within Java. So first, we're going to look at the dependencies that we require for our project. Then we're going to look at how we can create a workbook. And then finally, we're going to populate it with some demo data. So to begin, we need to import the Apache POI and the POI XML libraries. I'm doing this in the POM XML file I have as it's a Maven project. And these libraries come configured with the appropriate classes to create our workbook. I've created an application class with a public static void main method. And the first thing we want to do is to create a workbook object. And we do this using the XSSF workbook from the Apache package. So XSSF stands for XML Spreadsheet Format. And once we have our workbook object created, we can define a worksheet object using the XSSF sheet object and by calling the create sheet method from our workbook. So we're going to populate our sheet with multiple names of different football players. I've created this football player class and it has multiple properties. So we have a name, which is a string. We have the age, the number of goals, and the number of games, all as integers. And then we also have the team and league that the football player belongs to, and these are both strings. And then just below that, we have all of the getters for these properties. I have also annotated it with the builder annotation from the Lombok package. And this is just helpful for when we come to creating our football player instances. And then back in the application class, I've got this method called create player list. And this very simply returns a list of different football players. And I've just populated it with some demo data. So, so far we have an empty worksheet in Excel. And now what we want to do is to populate it. And we can populate each cell by specifying a row and a column index. So cell A1 in an Excel sheet is going to be 0, 0. A2 is going to be row 1 and then column 0. And B2 is going to be row 1 and column 1. We want to iterate through our playlist with a for loop. And for each player, we want to create a new row. So within our Excel sheet, we're going to have all the data for each player on each individual row. So we're going to define an integer outside of the loop as zero. And for each player that we iterate through, we're just going to update that number by one. So the workflow for adding a cell is to first define a new row within our worksheet. We then create the cell by specifying a specific column on our worksheet, and then finally by setting the value in that cell. We can define a row object from the Apache POI library by calling create row on our worksheet and passing in the row number. I'm also going to just increment that row number here. So we add one every time we go through this for loop. We can then create a cell in our row by calling create cell on that row and by passing in the column number we want to use. So I'm just going to define that column number as zero. So that means we're going to be populating all of column A. And lastly, we can set the value of the cell by using the player's name. When the loop executes, the first column for each of the first eight rows is now going to contain our player's name. And now we can actually use this workbook and we can write a file by using the file output stream. The file output stream comes from the core Java library. And I'll be passing in the file name of playerworkbook.xlsx. And then I'm going to call write on our workbook, passing in that file output stream so it writes to that directory. Now, if we run the application and open the workbook, we can see the player names printed in the first worksheet. And very quickly, I'm just going to play about with the columns and the rows. So if we change the row number to one and rerun the application, we can now see all of the data has just shifted down by one row. And if I change the column index to two, we can now see all of the data has shifted across by two columns. That concludes this video on how we can create a simple Excel workbook and populate it using Apache POI. 
and in the next video we will populate multiple rows and columns using more details from our player list.